Hey everyone, what is up and welcome back to Tetra Bay Gaming. So a few months ago, I made a video showing how I was able to get over 6,000 feet in the home run contest for Super Smash Bros for both Wii U and 3DS. Now at the time, I thought 6,000 was crazy in solo, but I've recently smashed that record and I'm going to share with you guys the technique on how I was able to get over 10,000 feet. Just a quick heads up however, this time around the method isn't as easy as in the other videos, so if you're looking to get quite the distance relatively easy, please click here to see how. But if you're willing to be patient and are ready for a method with a few more high-end techniques, then you're in the right place. I do not take credit for this technique as I have seen it other places online, however I'm going to do my best to try and explain it to you guys in simpler terms. Alright, your go-to fighter this time around is the newly released Roy. Now before we get in the ring, a little bit of a pretext. Roy's damage output appears to depend on how far away the sandbag is from him, so you will need to try a few times to get the right feel on how your spacing should be to get the maximum damage. Alright, with that out of the way, let's get started. Firstly, you'll want to do a short hop towards the sandbag. Once you get close enough, hit it with a forward air attack. Now this next part is important to save some time. Right after you hit with the forward air attack, fast fall to the ground by tapping the control stick down right after. This can save you a precious second, which is definitely what you need. Once on the ground, hit the sandbag three times with a crouch attack, followed by three forward side tilts. For me, it helps to count as I hit the bag. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3, and so forth, just so I wouldn't lose track. After the third side tilt, reverse and time a forward smash to hit the bag like so in midair. Finally, turn around once more and charge up Roy's special attack. Try and get as close to the bag as you can for this. If everything went well and the stars are aligned, the bag will land right in front of you and you'll send that bag packing. Now here it is at full speed with the results. The two biggest factors that I found which affect the distance are how close the bag is for the final hit as well as how long the special attack is charged for. Both of these need to be optimized to get over 10,000. However, even when not optimal, you can easily get over 8,000 feet with this method, which is not too shabby at all. As always, I hope this video helps you guys and I hope it helps you brag to your friends. If you're still having trouble with it after a while, please ask and I'll try my best to help you if I can. If this video helped you, or you enjoyed, and want to see more stuff in the future, please drop a like, comment, or subscribe. It would be much appreciated. That's all for today, guys. As always, thank you so much for watching, and I hope to see you in a bit.